faith leaders and welcome to break time. Today's proverb is 23 verse 4 and 5 which says, do not wear yourself out to get rich. Do not trust your own cleverness. Cast but a glance at riches, they are gone. For they will surely sprout wings and fly off to the sky like an eagle. Boy, he puts riches in perspective, doesn't he? Isn't it amazing if we put our energy and time in gaining riches, we will run out. That's exactly what Solomon is saying. If our focus becomes our riches, our paycheck, even at work, have you ever noticed if you're working for a paycheck, just how your energy is lost and you feel drained a lot? It's because your focus and your perspective, my perspective becomes on the money instead of my work and what I'm doing to try to accomplish my work. And so he's, he says, if you're working to gain things of this world, they will, you will run out of steam. You won't have enough energy. We weren't created to work so that we could gain riches. Now I sit and ask myself, then is God a killjoy? Is God trying to take away my things of the, the beauty of the things that have been created in this world that we're not supposed to enjoy them? No, that's not what this is saying. But when they become our focus, when we, when they become our perspective, when they become the motive behind why we want to go to work or why we want to um we want to make more money is so that we can have more toys it soon becomes you soon find yourself becoming lethargic because we were never meant to gain strength from things um not things that are not eternal so where do we put our focus and energy and time you know i think we can we can really kill this spirit that tries to raise itself up in us by focusing our time and our energy and our re and the resources that God has given us on our relationships, those are the things that will make it to the next. Those are the things that will make the eternal trip. Those are part of your, your truest identity is how well you do your relationships. And it takes a lot of time and energy, but you will never regret that. When you focus there, if things of this world, they're trying to gain riches and trying to get a bigger house or trying to get a, whatever it is, you just don't, your energy depletes itself. But when our focus becomes about people, relationships, those are eternal matters. So sometimes we need a perspective change. And as we begin this new year, I'm praying that as we walk in, we'll begin to focus on what's really significant and important. And you, my friend, can be blessed. Many people ask me, how is MSM supported? And I want to say by you, you are the reason that we can continue sending break times out, making videos.